Welcome to the practice of the daily office. In this practice, we are seeking to ground our lives more deeply in God's presence as we create space each morning, midday, and evening for silence, scripture, and prayer. In our morning prayer, we will read scripture with Jesus. You will need to choose a passage for this morning and be ready to read it. You may read a passage that is meaningful to you in this season, or join with Christians around the world in reading one of today's lectionary passages. You can find a link to the lectionary above on the website or below if you are on YouTube. But let's begin in silence. Silence helps us to settle the internal and external noise and distractions that so often stand in the way of our ability to hear the Lord. Take a deep breath. Remember right now that God is personally present with you. Psalm 139 says there is nowhere we can go to escape God's loving presence. And it says that you are so precious to God that the Lord's thoughts about you outnumber the grains of sand. Take another deep breath. God is closer than the air we breathe. These next moments of silence are yours to rest in the presence of the Lord. Let's read scripture with Jesus. Read slowly and reflectively, listening to what the Lord has to say to us in this text today. Read the passage you have chosen now. In this space, familiarize yourself with the passage by reading it through one time. Now I invite you to read the passage a second time. This time, pay attention to what stands out. Is there a word or a phrase that strikes you? Is there some part of the text on which the Holy Spirit seems to be shining a light? What part of the passage are you drawn toward this morning? 
read the passage a second time now. stands out to you in this passage. Have a conversation with God about this part of the text. Become curious. Why is the Holy Spirit guiding you to this part of the passage today? What questions do you have? What do you wonder about? Is God inviting you to respond in some way? Speak to the Lord and listen. Have a two-way conversation with God in prayer. Finally, read this passage one more time. This time, do not look to receive anything from the text. Simply allow yourself to soak in the Word of God as you read in the presence of Christ. Read the passage one last time now.
Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit.